Hello. Uh, hey. How's it going? Uh, me no hear nothing. Uh, actually, I don't see nothing either, now that I think about it. There's nothing on my screen. There is on this screen, not this one. What the hell's happening? Brrr. Okay, what did we do last? Uh, what's this even called? I don't even know what this is called. All right, welcome back. And now we are gonna continue our quest here. Our quest and the shadows of the estate. No idea what that is. Ah, oh, yeah, meet up with Sebastian and Fieldcroft. So we're gonna go meet his sister. I don't need to even use the door because it's too far away. Like, yeah, I'm just gonna head out there manually. No, I'm not gonna do that. There's fast travel, I'm gonna use it. <laughs> I'd had nothing unlocked over there. <laughs> so we're gonna spend a couple of minutes flying here. Hope you don't mind. I'm trying to gently flutter going down. But there's, there's like no soft setting. It's like hard all the way or feather it with tapping it. Um, Sebastian, you're supposed to be here, bud. So, I mean, I'm gonna, I'm gonna spin around a couple of times. Get comfortable. Hey, Sebastian. You made it. You just gonna let me sit there? You gonna walk past me and enjoy the view? Enjoying the view. Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always mm -hmm. the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift our spirits. Out. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on, I'll take you to my uncle's. Can't wait to meet your uncle. Sounds like a lovely guy. <gasps> oh, look, my fast travel. Now you should be able to travel to and from. Feldcroft used to be a lot livelier. <laughs> you just got cut off. With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Where are we going? Here? Here we are. Okay. My sister should be just inside. After me? That's gonna achievement. Aha! Sebastian, where did you... Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel fix cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. What a jerk! The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure. Why are you set on that? When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept it. <laughs> now look what you've done. <laughs> you did it. I'm what sorry. the hell? <laughs> if that isn't gaslighting, holy shit. I'm sorry you had to see that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Um, Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he'd hoped for. Uh, okay. That boy will fray my last nerve. I didn't know Excuse you had me, any. I thought they Mr. were still. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. He thinks he can help Anne. But nothing can be done for her. Uh, do I, do I say sure there's nothing or something like, or do I just apologize? Cause I mean, I didn't even do anything. How about, you know, I didn't do anything. I'm just going to say certainly there's something. That you've not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you sound like Sebastian thinking you know better than the healers at St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. 
Wow. Some sort oh. of dark magic <coughs> cursed Anne. <coughs> and the goblins aren't likely to explain <laughs> themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the loyalists' way. Uh... Hope can be a good thing. I mean, I, I believe so. With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you, you remember in? what I've said. With the Good goblins, day. sir? Oh, the goblins already spoke I'm to you and you're just about earlier. being a jerk. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Are you all right, Anne? I, I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. <laughs> and I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts. And often suddenly, it's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met on my first day at Hogwarts, in the Slytherin common room. Oh, the common room. Oh, I adore teasing first years about spotting mermaids through the window. <sighs> I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cosy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me, and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. I mean, he did make it I'm afraid fine. it's really up to Sebastian, and his mind seems to be made up. I can only hope he realizes the futility of his search for a cure soon. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. I wish you well. I ought Ooh. to see how Sebastian's faring. A letter from Sebastian Swallow to his sister Anne. Oh, dear Anne, Hogwarts isn't the same without you. Well, Sharp is still foul, but I hope you know what I mean. I hope you feel. I hope you are feeling better, Sebastian. Blah, 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 blah. A letter from Anne Swallow to Sebastian Swallow. So many swallows. Sebastian, this is my potion kit, not yours. Leave my things be. <laughs> okay, so he's like. Tinkering with everything. Reminds me of my cousin. He gets into everything. Why will he not listen to me? Oh, you look. She's my sister. Pissed. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first hand glance of what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. Man, well, you're all apologizing. What the hell? Uh, I know he's angry, but he's only trying to do what he thinks is best for Anne. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Aye, aye! Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be are underestimated. We, are we going? I mean, sorry to hear about your sister, but are we going? <laughs> All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. Digging for what? Just something? Up there, oh, yeah, relic of on that sort. plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. Hey, is this the area where uh, Professor Rackham 
How much longer are we? Was like, first year. Rabble. Ramrock knows what he's doing. It's an honor uh, to be a part of it. Excuse me. Accurate. Also. That sounds like my bud right there. Oopsie. Man, nice to know, Sebastian. You're gonna open up with that one spell you taught me. Mm, I love suffering. Red Rock for what? Man, good thing there's so much stuff to throw around here. Conveniently placed, too. Oh. Uh, what? No, no, watch out, sir. Oh, told you. Capringo. Potatoes. Sorry. <laughs> oh, you're still alive. I was looking around, wondering who was still You've left. Oh, your you're last still mistake. left. Are you sure this is my last? Ah, I mean, I'm gonna make a lot more. You seem tired. I seen what? I seen what? I need you to come here. What? What did you say about me? Does this seem tired to you? I mean, I missed that, but whatever. Yep. Shut up. Come up here and what? Hmm. Gotta love it. Come here. Oh, go away. Yo, did you see that? Why that was like over a thousand damage. About. Come here. <laughs> zap, zap, zap. Mooncalf. Come here, Mooncalf. Oh. I am happy you missed. Come here. Go away. Oh, they ran into each other. Oh yeah, I got this thing for freeze damage. I'm trying to use that spell now. Oh, we ended them all too, huh? That was sad. I could have did that challenge, but now it doesn't matter. Oh, got a nice little hand warm up in there. Are you? Oh, look at you, buddy. <laughs> you oxen around? Anyway, Sebastian, what are we doing? Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. Death. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing By the towards way, this is just fire, mineral water. worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly... An icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. What does that even mean, should be seen and not heard? Visible but quiet? It sounds as if the loyalists attacked Anne without cause. I wouldn't put it past them. But I'm convinced that they were trying to hide something. It may be grasping at Billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we Rookwood have a look around? Castle, huh? Is that the they seem to have set up camp here for a side? specific reason. They have stations for everything. Revelio. Ooh. Uh, uh. Investigate. I've heard goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the ministry isn't doing more. Aha. Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. Um. Ah, there we go. Pardon the weird yawn there. I was literally yawning and that felt weird. Whose home was this? Who's been abandoned long since I've lived here? Rebellion. 
centuries ago. But that's yeah, what I heard. It might be worth taking a closer look at the house itself. Oh, is that not what I'm doing right now? Oh, never mind. It's literally right there. Yeah, so ain't this the well that we saw in a cutscene with Professor Rackham? Some time ago? This well looks familiar. Oh. Uh, what about this view? Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. Oh. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. Um, yeah. Anyways, a second. Revelio. Nothing else, huh? Sebastian, over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could What's be. in it? You can't see but the it face. It looks to me as though this was intentional. It looks like Darth Maul. Like, you know, you see the face, it's like all red, covered up, painted. Is it Darth Maul? Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you- I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. The keepers, huh? She was one of the keepers. The keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library. I'm not following you. <laughs> I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces yes. of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Yeah. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. If I didn't know you, I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, Ooh, isn't why it? Why did he have to lay it like all that? on the table like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. So let's Look keep it us. This. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking <laughs> yeah, something? Yeah, just, just add piles Only of rocks that can't crawl over that. Okay. Uh, why Ooh. bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something uh, here. Um, I to look. think I need that light spell. Um. Are those vines in Harry Potter? This Luma is strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. You just walked in here nonchalantly. I've traveled here to learn, but I long to help. My internal struggles is overwhelming. It is as though the magic wants to heal, and I am the one preventing it from doing so. Should I lose hope? Well, I forever regret not having done more. I cannot look into their eyes knowing that I could lessen the burden of heartache. I saw the man leaving camp today, or the man? Should be a man? The one who reminded me of my father. Surely it wouldn't hurt to help him. I could further my research, of course, but that would be fortuitous, or be a fortuitous consequence of doing something good with this ability. Fortuitous, what do you mean by that? Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Ugh. It is my second week of the camp. More arrive each day. The muggle doctors and even some of our own healers are doing all that they can for them. The grief is palatable. Uh, palpable? Palpable. Yeah, okay, anyways. The one who has... Survive the plague are forever damaged by their loss. A fever may pass, the skin may mend and scar. And scar? A scar. But the devastation sorrow remains. I saw a man much like my father, 
who had lost a ch child. I couldn't bear it. I longed to give him some shred of relief. I'm beginning to think that the w others are wrong. I have the power to help souls, or these souls. It seems arbitrary not to help them as it would be to rid them of their torment. So, I think a journal entry Bella says doors. something about helping her... I should hold on to this. Father? And Rackham told her no? Ooh. Um, is this all we got? Hello? Revelio. Are we done here? Fashion? Um, okay, I guess I'm gonna leave now. No, it just says explore the cellar. I seem to have discovered a hidden cellar. Perhaps it holds what the goblins have been searching for. So I Lumos. still haven't gotten anything. Tried. What do I do? Oh, that's hurting me. That's hurting me. Ah, I see. Yeah. Gotta make me work for it. To believe this, I can see the Undercroft. What? The Undercroft. A daydream, because that happens to me too. No, Sebastian. I mean, I can really see the Undercroft. I know it sounds strange, but honestly, I... nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. I mean, that's not me I'm wielding still not it, sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be floored. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even Ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway, here we come. Ah, uh, no I'm reason to hang around here anymore. Just straight to Hogwarts, right? In terror. Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. Ooh. I see a cliffside and everything else is missing. So is this a map? I mean, we do got the map chamber Why already. Why triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. This is a note? I see scribbling, ancient magic symbol, ancient magic scribble, 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 ancient magic symbol. Anything helpful in the note? Sort of. A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the Keepers. I've been thinking. A Keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to triptych. unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not? Is it connected to our common room? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. 
But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Okay. Till then. Till then. Fare thee well. Quest complete in the shadows. Oh no, look at that. I got more gear to equip. What if I don't want to wear my scarf? Ah, uh, yep, yep. I kind of feel like gear is almost kind of wasted on this game. I, gotta, I personally believe that we don't need the gear. We should just be able to cast spells and slowly bump up our abilities and stats. Meet me near the ruins of Falbottom Castle. Oh, no, I, dark, I hate do you. Anyone. I don't. I probably won't tell anyone because I just don't want to be around you. What button's the quest button? That's. Oh, no, that's Al's. That's not. There we go. Jay's quest. The high keep. What's the high keep? Oh, I need to learn Leviosa. A 10 astronomy class. I can do that. I had to wait until dark for astronomy class. Oh, that is awesome. And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps Ow. you're due for an adventure. Ladies, Professor Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, started. if you were to devote yourself to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Ooh. Yeah, like, what a jerk, like about the whole divination thing and our cards like you just got there Still, you don't you have don't to make have like a down putting you comment you can't be the new student forever you know you can share with Mr. Takar hey what's up buddy here I can adjust that for no, you no no bring it into focus on your own I got this, I got it, yeah, stars. That still looks really blurry. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mm -hmm. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very self-same stars above us. Yeah, they're probably wearing more clothes, Is too. Is that clear? That has nothing to do about everybody else freezing. <sighs> Whew. Dismissed. What is that behind the telescope? Hello. Hello. I don't believe we've met officially. I'm Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? Correct. I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. Uh, thank That's you. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? Nope. I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I, I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some uh, reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. 
I don't want to get into your lewd magazines, brother. Why did I say it like that? Wait, do I need... He said lower deck. Oh, good, that did. How do I get to the lower I'm deck? I'm supposed to find Sirius, and my hands are too cold to use a tele... Oh, right there. It's a dog, isn't it? I thought I saw something shiny over here earlier. I don't see it now, though. Wow, that's, uh... That's kind of beautiful. Anyways, that telescope. There's somebody's... This there we was go. his old telescope. <laughs> Oh, I guess I need to take that to you. <sighs> Don't talk to me, Teach. Don't talk to me. The perfect night for... I have the telescope. It's nicer than I'd expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> but there is, um, something else. Yes, yeah. what is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. Hidden? Eh. And you like help finding them. And you need someone to help find it. I do. Are you in? No one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. All right. I suppose I can join All you. All right. I suppose I can go with you. I hope it's worth it. It will be. Trust me. I have read practically everything there is to read about this. It should be brilliant. Shall we? We shall. The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform, something that doesn't quite belong. Okay. We'll know it when we see it. All right. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally Trying to follow by this path that's... Oh, we're going off the path. Hmm... Okay, here's the castle wall. Out here at night, is it? Revelio. Or something chime over there. What are these? A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, of course. It's just not as yeah, yeah. as I expected. Oh, it's one of those kids, huh? Mother, there's dirt on me! Oh no, not this close to school, I meet. The constellation um, should appear near the center of your view. Ah, okay. So I need to rotate. That looks about right. And as soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Zoom. Adjust, adjust, enhance, enhance again. There we go. Alira. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. Ha, if you say so. Whatever you say, I'll meet. Whatever you say. <laughs> oh, you wait. You are going to be quoted saying just that. This is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest, all beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. Gobbledygook? It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Um, anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. All right, thanks for the telescope. Yeah, that dude is awesome. Hey, yeah, mate, you want to see something? Woo! <laughs> Over, like, by the Quidditch course, okay. 
Welcome back. Hegagawa. Have you finished your assignments? Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. And you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our restore momentum. A charm, incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. What's a quaffle? Is that a person? Precise, deliberate movements. Precise, deliberate. Deliberate, got it. That, <laughs> that was deliberate. I already knew I was gonna mess up. Just a, just a smidge. He sounds like Potter. Oh, uh, Barnacle Bigsby, maybe. Very good. You know that actually wouldn't surprise I me if that wasn't a voice that they put in here. As much as possible. Okay, practice new spell. Got it. This spell. Arrest the That's it. Keep it up. Okay. Not an expert. Use it one time. Learned it on the first try. I am the expert. <laughs> right now, I'm trying to progress as many of the spells as possible. Ah, where is Natty? I don't want to meet Natty. I hate Natty. I hate Onai. Ah, right. Attend divination class during the day. I mean, I need to learn the spells. I mean, I'm, I'm trying to progress, but at the same time, I kind of need the spells to progress, so I might as well just unlock the spells. There, flu flame. Oh, I was like, is there a flu flame keep nearby? An eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Ah, uh, yes, the gobstones, like that one right there. Oh, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. That's a lot of tea. You like see all that tea? <sighs> Ma'am, can you not drink so loudly? Ironically, I didn't see ahead of time. Who has a class up here? How do you, you know what? Never mind. I was gonna say, how do you get all this stuff up here? But wizards. Because I know for a fact that table would not fit through that uh, doorway. What's that even about? Yeah, I know, you're like really confused. You were just reading a book, now you're staring into a cup. Onai's mother seems very so cautious. Adelaide Oaks, isn't it? I received your owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Oh dear. You see, my uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. Uh -huh. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. And you want me to go find him? In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins. Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. What with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumors that goblins may have been involved. Well, I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle or am I overthinking this? I think you should tell a teacher. Yeah, you should be worried. Why am I a student? Needing to go through and solve everybody else's problems, even adults' problems. I am a kid or a child. I am under of age on here. I think you're right to be concerned, Adelaide. Your uncle may be in trouble. You're much more understanding than Professor Weasley. She heard I was going to look for him and forbade me from leaving the grounds. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's all right. I... Uh, could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. 
Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, fine. I can do I'll that. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record keeping. Notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last hour, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. Mm-hmm. Ah! What do we have? Oh. I hope those hey assignments were challenging enough for you. Uh, um, yeah. I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious. I'm based not. upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come, what do you see in your own future? You just asked a lot of things there that frankly can go anywhere. Hmm, yeah. Uh, well, I see power, but I also see a lot of danger. I can't get rid of this feeling of a coming danger. I see. Know that such omens are not damning if they can at least prepare us. And you are preparing yourself even now. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. Mm. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Channel your magic towards your oh. targets. Okay, yeah, channel, channeling, channeling. I'm very furious. Channeling all my anger. And tell people to get down. I hope Adelaide's uncle. <laughs> Adelaide mentioned her uncle's camp. Maybe near Brockborough, past the river. Rebellion. Uh, might as well grab that while I'm here. Paw mystery model. Let's try. Yeah, well, whatever. Actually, since I'm here, I should. Pro Ooh, you got a letter. I don't want to read it. Madiwa Onai, under Professor Black's direction. It is my honor as deputy headmistress to offer you the position of Div divination professor at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft. Yeah, witchcraft and witchcraft and wizardry. We are thrilled at the prospect of having you join our distinguished faculty. Please inform us of your intentions as soon as possible. I eagerly await your response. Warmest regards, Professor Matilda Weasley. Yeah, anyways. I think I open up the map and then I press the F key, F to wait. Fine now, dummy guys. Oh no, you are you still here after dark? Did we just chill? Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Fine. Rowan Oaks campsite. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Um, Revelio. Did I not already get it? I'm confused. Why is that so far away? Why is everything so far away? Come to the castle. Leave the castle. Come to the castle. Leave the castle. Roland Oaks, are you this here? Mr. Oaks is campsite. I'm not stylist. Just hey, what's up? What? Be discreet. Arrest over there. Potatoes, man. I'm blocking him. Now to find out what happened here. No, okay. Based on what Mr. Oaks's hmm. trade journal. Renrock's lot agreed to meet. But I do feel a tad uneasy. They attended the or they attended their request and were angry when I asked questions. 
I overheard some of their plans in Gobblegoon, Gobblegook, and they're after my rare metal deposits that are suitably for drilling, or suitable for drilling. I'm afraid of upsetting them further. They seem rather violent, volatile, I want to say violent, and I need this transaction to happen. Perhaps we can work out a compromise. Perhaps not. That's a lot of paper, but I guess that's all I'm reading. Okay, so what happened here was I came in here full of badassery and I completely won. Slayed all the goblins and where do I go from here? Rebellion. Oh, okay. That says a lot right there. Can you please go get it? Yeah. Mm. Rebellion. Ha yeah. I already got it on there. Repairer. What am I doing wrong? That's that's where I go, right? Wait, map. Adelaide said that her oh. uncle kept notes of his trades. Maps. Okay. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. I mean, I thought I had to go in there, but oh, I have to. You know what? Yeah, I gotta actually follow said map. Uh, Mr. Can we stop moving? Journal. Okay. Maps, 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 quest. Where are we? Can I view that map? Or not? Merlin's map depicts a few key landmarks. Perhaps I can use them to help me work out where the goblins have taken him? Yeah, can I get a... Can I, can I view that again? I want to view that again. That's... I did the dumb, where I pressed buttons without looking at what I was doing. Now I'm sitting here, I'm sitting here lost and confused on what I'm trying to do. So, I remember squiggly on the map, it looked like it might have went right. That's all I remember. A rock formation? That's the first landmark on this map. Ah, where is the... Now to find the crooked tree. Crooked tree, got it. This could prove dangerous if we were careful. Oh. I left. Oh, I can't. The balsa. The balsa. Potato. Potatoes. Confringo. Ah. Now I hope this is where I needed to go. That's the crumbling tower, right? It appears that the Laylist was set up in the ruins depicted on the map. Is, is this what's depicted on the map? I don't know. La, da, 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 da. Come on, come on. You don't see me. You really didn't see me. You don't see me again. Nobody's here. Hmm. Not the best place for an unaccompanied student. <laughs> yep. Oh. oh, you saw me already? You guys sound angry. You're not angry, are you? What's going on? Oh, little moon, little moon calf. I ain't no little moon calf. I'm a big one. Uh, back to being a 
invisible or highly cloaked is appreciated. Go to airborne Another. enemies. That's what I need. We don't need a ladder. We just want a ladder. Did I even need to come through the front door? Can I just flew around? I can. I can fly. Oh, oh hi. Mm. There we go. Hey, you up there. Quit it. Hey, that thunder, though. Can I climb this? Too high to climb. But you know what isn't too high to climb? This. I was never locked up here. Why is it? Don't you try again, I beg! Akio! Incendio! Good friend of This is the spot on the map. It's about me. Okay, this is the spot on the map, right? Revelio. Re. Um. He's this looks not like here. trouble. He's not here. Confringo. My boy, we're gonna have to get you a new outfit. Professor, I'm coming to save you. Me, a student, not a teacher, not any other adult, just me. What will we find in here? We will find only death. I don't like how I said that and immediately started hearing some pitter patters. Um, actually, I can open this up. Go to talents. I think stealth was one of my things I could do here. Now, there we go. Sprint. Oh, disillusioned. Yeah. It's punishment to us all to have that miserable human around. Ah. What'd you call me? <laughs> Press F to unlock. There we go. I wonder how much of this I can actually sneak. I want to be like the stealthiest of magic ninjas. Um, wow, well, and sure, over there doing whatever you do. I'm gonna just touch by it. I broke in here for no reason. Oh, maybe I did have a reason. Better not look at me. Better not look at me. Better not look at me. Oh crap. Oh. You guys good with that? Hello? No, no, you saw nothing. Ninja! Oh, what are you doing? Mmm. Yeah, anyways. I thought I was being super s stealthy like and he's just gonna bust out of the ass like what's up A human's 
word is worthless. This prisoner owes us the metal we were promised. Uh, prisoner metal promised. Excuse me, coming through, coming through, coming through. Don't no, ignore me. Sneaky, sneaky, sneak. Boiler door. How to open it? Sneaky, sneaky, sneak. How you guys doing down there? Uh -oh. I'm not an intruder. I, I, I'm a, I'm a student. Uh oh, I did not dodge. Uh oh. There's a lot more of you in here than I thought there was. Oh. I'm pretty sure you would. Go. Ho 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 ho. Why can't I hit you? Yeah, you already hit me earlier. Come here. I use that spell wrong every time. Potato, Akio. Why is the best? No, never necessary. No, Akio. Incendio. Akio, incendio. Akio, incendio. Well, stealth is ruined now. Um, I don't feel the need to be the mage. Ni Lumos. I wonder if Adelaide's uncle could be down there. Mm -hmm. Super stealth, super stealth. No! That wasn't supposed to be used on you. That wasn't supposed to be used on you. No, it wasn't. Okay. It's like I just gotta deal with you all day. There we go. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh. Incendio. Oh. A, bit of, a little bit of heat on your eyes. Go away. Your blood's on Ranrock's hands. Hello? Why is... Mr. Oh, because he died underneath Ranrock. They've taken my wand. This cell has an enchanted lock. I have experience with these locks, but I need my wand if I have any chance of opening it. Look for a boiler door. I've heard them speak of it. I need to find a Mr. Rose's boiler wand. door? Where could it be? Is that how oh, I gotta go all the way back out? A boiler that I made a comment about earlier? This one? Incendio. Um. I'm here. Oh, right. It is a boiler. Uh. Pipes go that way. How do I get to where said pipes are? Couldn't bring up. Incendio. I, um... Incendium. I wanna... Okay. I don't think I need to be here, but I am now here. Oh, 
Oh, and a bunch of potions? Thank you, thank you, thank you. So now I gotta go all the way around up here to open that door. Though it should mark something else other than that door. There's the boiler. Confinger! Man, that was the easiest puzzle ever. It just took me a minute to get to it. Um. Lumos. <laughs> One way or another, we'll um. get what we're owed. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of you. Do 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 boo do do boo gonna massacre a bunch of fucking zombies. Not zombies, goblins. <laughs> um These hands, they're overworked. Celebratory jump. Look, calm and concise. I heard there was a wand back here. Is it galleons? This must be Mr. Oaks's wand. I like Perhaps how they gently put free. his wand on a stand. I mean, like, realistically, if it was any modern person's wand, I'm pretty sure we would have just threw it on the table. Like, yeah. I'm trying, just quiet. Actually, I'm more curious how you knew I gave it or that I got it. Is that your face? I can't see it. Oh, you're, you're you savvy. You did it. Oh, you found my wand and, wait, you're a student? Oh, we must get you to safety immediately. It's dangerous. It's all right, Mr. Oaks. I've dealt with these goblins before. Dear Merlin, you're either very lucky or very talented. Well, how did you find me? I'm a friend of Adelaide's. She was worried about your business with Ranrock's loyalists. Oh, she was right to be. I couldn't go through with the agreement, and when I told them, I ended up blindfolded and behind bars. Been locked in that infernal cell for so long, they'd forgot I was even there. I overheard things. If only I could reward you for what you've done. Blasting goblins stole every canut on me. All I can say is thank you, truly. What's a canut versus a galleon? Is it galleons? I forgot what they were. Glad to help. I'm grateful I was able to help you, Mr. Oaks. Adelaide thinks the world of you. Oh, and I her. She's become quite savvy to my trading habits, always analyzing my detailed owls. Oh, if only I hadn't resorted to trading with such fiends. Hmm. A lesson I shan't soon forget. Having my wand back is like being reunited with an old friend. I must return home and inform Adelaide of my safety. Will you be all right? I'll be fine, Mr. Oaks. You get can, back to Adelaide. Can we just get out of here? I'll assure you, her worries outweigh yours. Oh, I'm anxious to see my dear niece. And then I plan to travel far from here for my next round of trading. Thank you. May life reward you justly for your deeds. Be well, my friend. Very well. 
Oh, I thought you were just going back to the cell for a quick second. Hanrock's lot would never have freed him. Can, can we leave now? I would prefer not to walk out. I would prefer. Okay. I was, oh, I gotta walk out. I don't want to walk out. I keep hitting escape like dum dum. Okay, so we learned astronomy today, or did an astronomy class. We got, we we're given a telescope. What else did we do? I got lost. Lost a couple of games of Summoner's Court. Continuing to get lost. Let me get out of here first. I'll summarize everything up here in a second. Oh. Yes, me out now. Thanks. Yeah, I know you haven't seen daylight in a minute. Okay, that's hog's meat, hog warts. Why is everything about a hog? I don't know. Why is my light white? Anyways, so we've visited Sebastian and his sister. We found out that there is a portal from his hamlet to the Undercroft. I had to think of what that was called for a second. We've attended, I think, divination class and astronomy. We've rescued Oates' uncle. I think all in well, we did fairly good job today. Now to identify my gears, and I'll catch you all next time in the next episode. Thanks for watching.